is here invisibly in the church, and not even totally invisibly, that the Lord in his mercy gives us sometimes the, the presence of the great saints who, who for a while they're in this world, are, are a manifestation of the visibility of the kingdom of God. But, but basically, the presence of the kingdom of God in this world, in the church, is an, an, an invisible presence, a presence that must be perceived with the eyes of faith. At the end of the age, the invisible kingdom becomes visible. Does the church, is, is there actually an overlapping of it? Would, you, would the church teach that, for example, in the Eucharist on Sunday, that there's almost a uniting of, yes. of the two? Yes, that when we, when we partake, as I quoted St. John Chrysostom earlier, when we partake of the Holy Eucharist, we have heaven within us. That the, because the he- heaven is Christ, paradise is Christ, the kingdom of uh, the kingdom of God is Christ. When we have Christ within us, then we partake as far as it is possible to partake in this world of what is the kingdom of God. Yet, nevertheless, that presence of Christ in the Eucharist can can be perceived only by the eyes of faith. It is not a visible presence. It is not a tangible presence. That's why we say. Uh, after the people have received Holy Communion in the liturgy and the priest goes back to the altar, uh, he says, actually, he says this prayer quietly, but it's, it's uh, very beautiful. He says, O Christ, great and most holy Passover, wisdom, word, and power of God, grant that we may more perfectly partake of you in the never-ending day of your kingdom, which will have no evening. That even the Eucharist points to uh, the fullness of the kingdom of God when, when even the Eucharist itself will pass away. So you see, I, the Saint John sa- tells us in the Book of Revelation that uh, there was no temple in, in in the city of the kingdom of God, in the eternal kingdom, because the Lord God Almighty Himself is the temple. When when the perfect has come, everything that is meant to bring us to the perfect and give us a partaking of, of the perfect through faith in this world, including the liturgy and the Eucharist, will pass away. But until then, it is our means. It, it is where we contact. Okay, till next time then.